anniversary of the end of the Locust War. Today, we are humbled by the presence of two generations of men and women who braved every danger, who fought the battles that made us what we are, including the most pivotal encounter of the Pendulum Wars, Ashbow Fields. Santiago! I'll spare you the inspirational speech, Private. You know what to do. Yes, sir. All right, let's do this. We take down those towers, cripple their communications, then raid the lab. Command wants the Hammer of Dawn, Command gets the Hammer of Dawn. Fight! Move! Move it, Gears! We're only gonna get one shot to extract those plans! Once we take down the comm towers, this entire base is cut off! Yes, sir. Got Indies! Up top! Take him out! Fire the falling off! Up the other door! Fire in the hole! Control. Come on, Gears. Colonel Hoffman's convoy is gonna need protection. Corporal, we're coming in hot! Almost there, Control! Oh, shit! That's the convoy! Look out! Look out! Four of those goddamn things! <laughs> what the hell is this in heaven? Secure that hammer! We've got the hammer! The hammer is out! Kill you! Let's in! 
Is it always like this? No. Huh? Welcome home, James. How'd you know we were here? Huh. That's new. Not that new. Dad, we need your help. I'm all done helping you. But this time, I'm not running from the cog. Dell, you win this too? Waist deep. <sighs> you were supposed to keep him out of trouble. Now, you know that's not possible. I'd introduce myself, but you'll be leaving soon. JD, show him. Show me what? Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Along with all our friends. Dad, you should look at this. No, you look. I warned you not to join the COG. What did you do? Dad. I told you, don't go outside here. The COG will hunt you down. Again, what did you do? Just shut up and look. You said you weren't running from the cog. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. God damn it, James! Ah, uh, Lieutenant. Time to finish our earlier conversation. Jin, listen, you, you have no idea what's actually happening here. Oh, but I do. Sedition. Led by one James Dominic Phoenix, the son of a famously disgruntled old gear. Speaking of which, Sergeant, how are you? Sorry about the door. Don't sweat it. We were just leaving. So we're clear, Sergeant. If you choose to aid these fugitives, I can't protect you. Yeah, that sounds about right. Son of a Have a way with people, Marcus. Just head for the back door. Shit. Let's put dealing with this first. Sniper up high! Hostile uh, targets acquired. new toys. Yeah, playing them all day. Come on, follow me upstairs. Wait, what's upstairs? Family heirlooms. Human. 
humans are no strangers to war. After all, we've been fighting for as long as we can remember. War is all we know. In the past, we fought for emulsion. We fought for country. We fought for freedom. But all that changed after E-Day. For 15 years, we've been fighting for our very survival against inhuman, genocidal monsters. But it is a fight. We cannot continue. Humanity faces extinction. Unless we end this war, now. So why land down, Sergeant? Why not just drill down here? Jacinto's the one place it can't dig through, and land down's a perfect spot to hit him on their own turf. Heard there's a shitload of grubs there, Sergeant. More like ten shitloads. We had hoped the light mass bombing would decimate the Locust Horde. But they survived. And have returned stronger than ever. They brought with them a force that can sink entire cities. Even Jacinto, our last beacon of hope through all these dark days, is now at risk. Soon we'll have nothing left to defend. And that means we have only one option. Attack. Gears, what I ask of you now is not an easy thing, but it is necessary. If we are to survive, if we are to live long enough to see the seasons pass, our children grow and experience a time of peace that we have never known. We must now take this fight to the Locust. We will go. 